Many are calling it a miracle. An 18-month-old baby girl survived 14 hours suspended upside down in her car seat in the Spanish Fork River. Tonight, we're learning more about the rescue and that mysterious voice that helped save her life. Fox 13's Annie Cutler just spoke with one of baby Lily's rescuers. She joins us from the crash scene in Spanish Fork. Annie. Yeah, hi, Hope and Bob. As you mentioned, I'm here at the scene of where this car flipped into the Spanish Fork River. And just behind me, you see that a small makeshift memorial has started with some candles and flowers and some balloons that have been placed here. Now, we spoke with one of the officers involved in the rescue, as you mentioned. He recalls what he saw and perhaps more importantly, what he heard before he realized baby Lily was in that car and still alive. Officer Tyler Beddoes was one of the first to arrive at the scene Saturday after police were called about a car that had crashed into the Spanish Fork River. The car was upside side down in the water. At first, Beddoes and the other officers could see only a driver who was not alive. But then, Beddoes says he and the three other officers heard someone shouting for help. We heard a voice, a distinct voice. It wasn't thinking. It wasn't, we actually heard someone say, help me, help me now, that type of stuff. They jumped into action, racing against time to save whoever was still alive inside the car. Something was there, and, and that pushed us harder when we heard that voice. To us, it was somebody's alive in that car, let's get in there and get them out. So anything we could do to get inside that car, we tried to do. They were able to flip the car over, only to see Lily unconscious and strapped in her car seat. I mean, miraculous. Who or where the voice came from may always remain a mystery. We all together said, yes, we heard that same voice. And so when we really talked about it, it was, it was then that it kicked in. The, the mom was obviously deceased when the car was uh, flipped over and the baby was unconscious. Uh, at the time and so for us it was just you know processing still processing what occurred and what happened officer Beto says he's just happy to hear Lily is doing well but to, to know that she's doing well is just uh, it's just I have kids of my own and so just to know that it's just amazing I can't really describe in words how you feel um, it's all worth it